is up guys, Indie Gamer Retro here, and welcome back to Ultima Quest of the Avatar, on my Ranger Run. Welcome to Moonglow, City of Honesty and Magic. Wait on the cape across the bridge. The gate appears when the left moon wanes. Alright. Meh. Down, stupid! Fuck. Does thou see it? Cast thou see it? No. Rune of Honesty, three steps south. Oh my god. Oh my god. <sighs> Holy crap, controller. Honesty Shrine lies on an island to the north. Seek first the rune, and then the blue stone of Honesty, which lies in the dungeon deceit. I am a fortune teller. Would thou care to know thy fortune? Sure. The Greek quest shall lead thee into the abyss, for the Codex awaits. This compendium of ultimate knowledge or some crap. Something to Spells Unlimited? Yes. Well, technically no, but... Magic of Sleep is made from Ginshing... Ginshing. Hell, hello. Ginseng and Silkweb. Gingshing. Right, give me some of that Gingshing. I am Basil, and I've got a secret. Would you like to know? Yes, I would. Not gonna... Tell me, you bitch. Have to leave and come back, maybe? Some right here. And low. I am Mariah, both adventurous and sorceress. And I am so weary of this place. Without on a noble quest? Yes. Might I come to thee? Yes, you can. Let us be off. Okay, okay. And one, two, three. Find the root of honesty. Ha ha! Ha 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 ha! Ah, you bastard. Dealer Parison. I can do it now. Yeah. Thou give of thy own blood so that another may live. Yes. Thou art strong in the way of virtue. Our boundless gratitude is thine. So it won't. I don't think it's. Yeah, so it won't let you go below 300 when doing this. That's like the only way to bring up sacrifice. Do that. I don't know how many times you need to do it to build it up. Welcome to Spells Unlimited, Britannia's leading magic book service. Ever been here before? All magic depends on the eight reagents. So thou canst use a magic spell only if that spell's recipe appears in thy magic book. Here at Spells Unlimited, we can write any known spell in thy magic book. Come by whenever thou has learned the ing yeah. learn the ingredients of every new spell. Which spell would thou have us write down? I'm not supposed to have Tremor yet? I didn't learn the third ingredient for Tremor. Controller, god fucking damn. Yeah, there's still one more person I gotta talk to. She's actually in pause behind that locked door. She tells you it's, um, the same thing with the man in black and Moss. Huh. That's weird. I wonder why it triggered now before talking to, like, the third person. Although, technically, the guy in Trent, the, not Trenting, the guy in Jalem is technically the third guy you speak to about it. So maybe if you talk to him first, it'll make it trigger? Maybe? So it's Ash. Moss. Manroot. It is done. So across 40 magic points. Holy shit. You slept. There was Jensing and Silkweb. So far it's 10, okay. Reflect. Ash, Ginseng. No. Ash, Ginseng. Fuck. Ash. Ginseng. Garlic. Fungus. There 
we go. Press 20 MP. And our flex spell, it blocks um, ranged attacks from enemies, not magic. Like, spells can still go through, but if it's a ranged attack, like from a bow type weapon, then it'll stop it. It'll say, like, it's been negated or some shit, which is fucking stupid. You would think it would be magic that's actually reflected, but no. Physical attacks. As we squish, smash, webber, moss, manroot. Part 28. Lie is never better than the truth. So I'll strive to always be honest. Yes, that is good. Thou must learn to be ashamed of the untruth thou dost tell. Are thou content with anything less than unblemished truth? Uh, what? Art thou content with anything less than unblemished truth? Well, content means satisfied, so are, are you satisfied with less... Are you satisfied with anything less than unblemished truth? Technically, the answer should be no if I'm understanding fucking old English correctly. I can barely understand modern English correctly. But I think this is one of the ones where I have to say yes. Honestly, it's a rob only from truth. Okay, so yeah, the answer should have been no, but because of, there's like a, a screw up somewhere in like the programming, some of the answers where you're supposed to answer no, you have to answer yes for it to be the correct input. For some silly reason. Okay. I didn't think to... I don't think you have it. No, you don't. Fuck. Okay. Should have bought a freaking sling when I was in Britain. I forgot. I just gotta wait for this get to get to two new moons. Blah. Oh, hello, Boto. Three keys may be taken from the altar room of truth, love, and courage, but only by use of the proper stones of virtue. And here we have the Lyceum, or the Lycaeum. I am Nigel, master of all wizards. Magic is strong enough to raise the dead. Life, thou knowest, is given only unto the highest of wizards. And it requires garlic, moss, fungus, and... Mm, well... And... And Marine of Empath Abbey will tell thee its final ingredient. I'm quite busy right now. No time for chit-chat. Uh, one more time. Okay, so life... Garlic, moss, fungus. The Marina of Empath Abbey will tell you the final one. You have to actually talk to her for it to trigger. Um, she doesn't actually tell you, but her last name suggests it, because her name is Marina Mandraka. It's supposed to be Mandrake, which is Manroot, so it, the fourth one is Manroot. Man. I hail from Trinsic, City of Honor. Its principles are truth and courage. No better way to so sacrifice than by giving of thy life's blood. Yes. Okay. I'm Father Angelus, philosopher of truth. Search for the book of truth where others are found. Which is over here in that frickin' locked room. Welcome to the Lyceum, stronghold of truth. Lady Beth can tell thee more. Truth is one of the three principles. Does thou know how many virtues contain truth? Four. There are justice, I'm sorry, honesty, justice, honor, and spirituality. Okay. Sort of paradise lies atop a magical altar above. Only a master of the eight virtues may claim it. Yeah, so if you try to go here. 
it was bringing to like a constant looping room until you actually reach Avatar Hood. Come back with a the key. There's also a guy in there that teaches you a spell. Uh, really there for the book. Oops, wrong way. <coughs> Each of the eight virtues save that of humility is made up of one of one or more of three principles of truth, love, and courage. After all, must know the ways. Look under our telescope and see thy path before thee. Telescope, you want to use it? Yes. Yeah, so. Alrighty, I'm not sure how a telescope lets you look at the entire world, but alright. Uh, so the little yellow bleepy dots are all the virtuous cities, you know, like Britain, Trinsig, Jalem, Mew, what have you. And the bigger blue dots, except for the one that's on the far bottom right, that one's actually the um, final dungeon. Uh, all the other ones are the shrine locations for the different virtues. And its size tells you uh, how close you are of attaining Avatar Hood for that virtue. So like the top five on that map, plus that small one in the bottom right. Uh, I believe I should be at well, so I'm not very far into that. But the bottom left two, which should be Valor and Honor, as you can see, are larger. I think that tells me I am very well. And then when you get to... You're about to reach Avatar Hood, or you can go get it for that virtue, it's even larger. But usually Valor and Honor will be the first two that you normally get to Avatar Hood first. Because you have to kill shit, so that's gonna go up, and then... Just as you're traveling, it's gonna just go up... Uh, for honor. Go up the piece away. Okay, so he can hit level four now. You haven't killed shit. Really need to get our sling and ingredients. And here we have Vesper. Problem is the a strong magic. Without swear to use it justly, yes. Pearl and fungus make the magic destroy. So destroy pearl. And for the longest time, I couldn't figure out how to, like, make Destroy work, because you would cast it in battle, and it just it didn't seem like it did anything. To wait, the way to make it work is you need to be surrounded by enemies, and it'll hit everything in a 3x3 three three area around you. Hello. Welcome to Vesper Village, the end of the world. Just a wizard guy. Hello. Keys which unlock the three principles lie in the dungeon altar rooms. Yep. That's a thing. Here the barkeep in intrinsic notes of fungus. Takes a liking to good tippers. So he likes just a tip, huh? I'm so happy for him. Trying of Humility is on an aisle south of Verity. There draws a devil near it, so beware. Yeah, that place sucks. Welcome to the guild. B, Torch, Gem, Key, Oil. Really need to have this. Everything else you can kind of do without. I mean, they're okay to have, but you don't really need them. Especially that, that's just fucking trash. It creates a uh, fire field in battle, and you step on it, it does damage. That shows you the map, or the dungeon floor, and that lights up dungeons. But you press select. Who told you that? Sextant. Get where you are if you use it. 900. So I need at least 2,900. This place. I'm told the scale of a legendary snake is in the mountain. 
Welcome to the weapon shop. What can I do for you, boy? Bow, expo, and sword. I can sell his axe. Get a sword. Actually, let me go ahead and... No, you yeah, actually know what? No, I'm not going to do that. I'm trying to get him an expo at some point. the Minox, City of Sacrifice. Yeah, so the uh, backstory for this town was they got fucked over when someone used the Skull of Mundane here. Shrines of Virtue demand the Ruins of Virtue. I must know. Yes, I do know. Sacrifice? I just care for others before oneself. Seek the Ruin and travel to the Shrine in the East. Right. Welcome to the weapon shop. Okay, what do I need? Uh, ooh. Uh, I'm gonna have to get this for a character, and that's gonna double as a ranged weapon, so that'll actually save me like 1500, I think is what the expo costs. I don't remember. But let me go ahead and get this for you. That doubles. Oh my god. M. Zircon, a very busy smith. A very, very busy smith. I'm going to come back to this room. Because I don't think I can survive it. I'm right here. Not quite, you still need another like 39 XP. I kind of lucked out with that group of wizards. Because they take two hits to kill with a bow. So I had um, Ranger and Jeff just kill a couple of them. And then single target the other ones. And then I had Mariah go in for the finishing kill. Man. Each virtue has a root, and each virtue has a stone. Only 
20? I don't know why I thought it was more than that. Okay. Seek the orange stone of sacrifice in the dungeon covetous. Which is actually south of here. Like, or, like up and around like the mountain range. That's on the south coast. Sacrifice brings some love and courage. Does thou have the courage to love others less fortunate than thyself? Yes. Show thy commitment. I will, and I've done it like four times already. I am Julius, and I stand for among I stand for the poor among us. Thou help? Yes. My thanks. May I accompany thee and do greater works abroad? Yes. Think of the good we can do together. There. Ah, to wield the skull of Mundane, to level a city, to slay all within. This power I can scarcely hope to claim. I have sleeping sickness. So, huh? Oh yes, so I've suffered a setsy bite. I'll buy me a drink, sure. Yeah, thank you kindly. The ruins in the Tinker's fireplace. Can have the walk no work, kind friend. Please, a single coin. I might think, sir, kind of waste the bear of the scale. Alms, alms for the poor. Without help. Have a nice day. Okay. Okay, I should be able to do this now. We're gonna sacrifice. Ooh, holy crap, just barely. I'm gonna go ahead and just call it here. Because I'm pretty much done with the towns for now. And there is technically two more towns I can go to, but I don't need to go to them now. And one town I can actually even just completely skip. Because I don't need to go there at all, but I have to swing by there. As I'm passing through to grab something else. So uh, when I come back. Uh, I'll probably gonna go ahead and start the dungeons, actually. So I'm ready to do that. There's a... Uh, I'm gonna head back to Vesper, hop on my boat, and then go to... Um, the seat, after I go and grab me some, um... Well, grab me some slings... ...in, a uh, Britain. And then, uh, I'll probably just meet you back at Vesper with the two slings, and I might buy, like, a couple of, uh, ingredients of each, maybe, like, a couple of gems. Maybe, like, a torch or two, and just so I don't have to use up all my reagents for shit. And then, yeah, after that, I think I'm gonna go ahead and start some of the dungeons. And I'll probably do them, like, in order, so I'll do the honesty, then compassion. I might even just do two in one episode, just so I can get them done quicker. And then, uh, I guess we'll just go from there. So until then, this is Indie Gamer Retro on Ultima Quest of the Avatar. Later, guys.